Are you thirsty? You look thirsty. Can I interest you in a refreshing bottle of hollow? How about seven bottles of hollow? Well, hello everyone, it's me, Christine, again. You know what they say, it's hollow o'clock somewhere. <laughs> Introducing the newest addition to the Hollow Taco lineup, the Pastel Rainbow Collection. It includes seven linear holographic polishes in all the colors of the Pastel Rainbow. For the sophisticated, but still hollow loving creature in you. <laughs> and dare I say, work appropriate? Life appropriate, me appropriate. <laughs> the new collection comes in this limited edition collector's box, which is giant. It's got these flowy hollow vibes that move when you move. When I move, you move. Just like that. Let's open it up and uh, who's thirsty for hollow? <laughs> I'm such a thirst trap. This box is my current seasonal aesthetic. Check this out. You can give yourself a holographic tan. <laughs> or it just looks stunning as a prop in the backdrop of your video calls. <laughs> so look, look at that. Look at that. You ain't gonna concentrate on anything I have to say in this meeting. <laughs> I realize it's been many months since we've released a full collection with Hollow in it. What's wrong with me? This is Hollow Taco Man. This is not Unicorn Taco. This is not Multichrome Taco. This is not Frosted Metals Taco. <laughs> you can head to the link down below in the video description box or go to hollowtaco.com to get your own pastel Hollow Rainbow collection. You can do that now or wait until the end of the video. I know some of you have already been checking out haven't you? Without even letting me finish, I see you in the analytics. I do hope if you're shopping already that you guys come back and finish this video though, because we're gonna have a little drink together at the end. Okay, now, time for some close-ups of the hollow. Say hello to the coolest, most refreshing hollow taco box to grace your shelves. A box that just by opening it will make you want to go for a swim for a quick dip in the hollow. Thirsty for hollow? Yes, ma'am. Open up and feed me. This collection box is limited edition and we have limited quantities available. So if you are new here, if you want one, my advice is to go grab yours as soon as you can. How many of the Hollow Taco Collectors boxes do you have? Comment down below. The nail polishes inside the box will also be sold individually and will be restocked if they sell out, assuming our Hollow supplier does not run out of Hollow. The full collection box set retails for $98, which is the same price as buying each of the seven new shades individually, which retail for $14 each. This price reflects the cost of the super strong holographic pigments in the nail polish, which is stunning and packed full of as much hollow as we can possibly put in the bottle. But as you may know, the good quality hollow is expensive, which is often why you don't see this kind of formula made by big box nail polish brands. This is a linear holographic formula, which means the polish goes on smoothly, doesn't feel gritty like glitter, and is full coverage in two to three coats depending on the shade. And once the polish is on the nail, the hollow kind of settles and refracts rainbows in the shape of a line that moves or dances depending on the angle of the light, hence the formula name being linear holographic. You will recall that our first collection of linear hollows was the rainbow collection from last summer, and now it's time to do the pastel hollow rainbow. It's only logical. I seen all your requests. I'm always taking notes. Just like the first rainbow collection, these new pastel hollows have a super hollow payoff with a smooth and lush application. This formula has definitely become one of our top sellers over the past year, and I think that's because it just goes on so smoothly and it's really easy to work with. There's no layering involved here, it just gives a crazy intense holographic effect of rainbows in just one bottle, and that's just not something you see much of on the shelves at your local drugstore. In part because the ingredients are expensive, but also I'd argue it's just harder and trickier to pull off making this formula well. But we did it and I'm super proud of the team for that and I know you guys are gonna love our new seven pastel hollows. Okay, enough on formula, let's get into the seven shades. Each polish name was inspired by a refreshment because that's just the vibe, wearing pastel hollow on your nails, like a refreshing holographic sparkle for your fingertips. The first bottle will pop is Pink Fizz. Are you feeling that hollow buzz? It's hard not to when the hollow is this strong. This shade is a very cool toned pink. It's like almost purple, but not quite. Maybe it's in between pink and warm purple, like an orchid pink. 
It's also kind of subtle because it's pastel, but also not because of the hollow. But it's very much on the pink side compared to our next shade, Lavender Syrup. This one's a pastel purple with a cool undertone. It's kind of bordering purple and periwinkle, like a frozen lavender or maybe violet on ice. This is a really versatile shade I feel like also really works during the colder seasons. And let's not be mistaken, with all the hollow in this bottle, this concoction is no simple syrup. Next up, for the day after a hollow hangover, maybe you need a big bottle of sparkling water. The doctor says you can never have enough H2 hollow. The doctor is me, I'm the doctor. <laughs> this shade is as blue as the blue-eyed girl's eyes and sparklier than fresh Fiji water. I think this is Ben's favorite polish of the collection because it reminds him the most of the possibility of going on vacation, but that's not happening in 2020 or 2021, so I'll paint his nails with some sparkling water instead. Next up, who wants a mint mojito? Which, unknown to you, I leaked at the beginning of this year when I dropped my oats collab. And you guys were all asking about that mint hollow? <laughs> I'm so sneaky, but not really, because I leaked it way too early. Mint mojito is a light holographic aqua mint shade that is just the perfect refreshment for your nail polish collection. It is truly a dream nail polish shade of mine. This is one of my faves of the collection because I just love mint and I love hollow being some prize. If you're not feeling the mint, maybe it's time to rejuvenate your nails with some lemon spritzer. This one's a soft pastel yellow gold, and it almost kind of glows a bit golden in addition to the hollow rainbows and certain lights. Don't sleep on the yellow shade because she's actually golden. For all the hollow detectives out there, you may remember seeing this one at the start of the year in my trying 2021 nail trends video. What am I supposed to do? I gotta test the prototypes. Now we're moving into the warmer tones of the rainbow. Ban, is that my peach tea? This shade is the perfect pastel peach hollow and is also kind of a neutral hollow, if that isn't an oxymoron. I feel like you could get away with calling this one office appropriate, especially you work in an office with boring lights. <laughs> Some of you have been asking for more neutral hollows, so I know you're gonna love peach tea. Just do me a favor and don't actually sip it, even though it's labeled peach tea, thank you. <laughs> but hey, you could spill it and say you spilled your peach tea. <laughs> Phew, we've seen so much hollow so far, we've gotta finish it off with a coral chaser. This one, I mean, ooh, she is such a unique shade of warm pink, red, and orange. Kinda like all the shades of a sunset on Temptation Island mixed together. My nails so flush with the hollow, it's like they're blushing. I would definitely take this nail polish to the fantasy suite. In addition to the mint, this shade has also gotta be one of my faves because it's just such a flattering shade and it's so unique, I feel like I don't see this one often. And as with any nail polish, to seal it properly, make it dry quickly, prevent chipping, and also let that hollow shine come through, don't forget to add a nice thick coat of glossy taco to complete your mani. I do plan on sharing some comparisons of these new shades to our existing polishes on the Holo Taco socials. So make sure you're following us everywhere, Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, and now TikTok. Over 6 million people watched this TikTok about duct tape gray nails. And no, I don't understand why either. <laughs> and did I mention that these linear hollows gradient beautifully? If you wanna see how to do this pastel linear hollow gradient, make sure you subscribe to the Hollow Taco YouTube channel and that video will be up next week. Simply do a nail art on another channel. <laughs> In terms of showcasing the hollow the best with lighting, my nails were mostly shot under some desk lamps with my DSLR camera, but honestly, the hollow is best seen with just your phone camera and the flash on. Sometimes it's just the simply things in life. Or the hollow really comes alive if you take your nails outside under direct sunlight. There's one great incentive to breathe some fresh air. I tried to capture all seven polishes while the sun was out, but I ran into some overcast skies. Xyler did not seem to mind. In the shade or indoors, not under direct lighting, the hollow won't be as obvious, but instead you'll see more of the pastel color. Basically, the nail polish needs to be in the spotlight to see the full hollow effect, so make sure you step into the sunlight or whip out your phone flash when you're explaining the hollow to other people. I feel like that's something I've been doing for years, just whipping out my phone, shining the light on my nails, and being like, look, no, look, now you see. 
As always, this collection is vegan, cruelty-free, and made and shipped out of the USA. If you're interested in the business behind the holo, we've done two episodes about holo taco on our podcast, Simply Podlogical. You can find that on YouTube, Spotify, and Apple Podcasts. I'll add some links down below, and there's also some shorter clips you can catch on our Simply Podlogical highlights channel. Because I don't just paint my nails with holo, I want to talk about it for hours. <laughs> All right, back to you, Simply. Okay, who wants to make a drink? <laughs> Menchie! Menchie, you're too young to be at the bar. That's right, you go back to the kids section. <laughs> so given that all the new shade names were inspired by drinks, I thought I'd make one myself. But I'm no bartender or barista, so instead of making seven different cocktails, I'm gonna mix them all into one. <laughs> I'm a mixologist. Let's start with some ice. Got some peach tea. Always use a spoon to open your drinks. Don't want to ruin your nails. Put about a third of peach tea in here. Pink fizz. Just a splash of lavender syrup. That's what this is. It's a work day, so let's just add some sparkling water. Spritz of lemon. Not in my eye. <laughs> and a few mint leaves to garnish. It's like mint mojito without the mojito. And of course, we've got to make a coral chaser just in case this tastes terrible. <laughs> Let's finish off with a couple cherries. Those are for an unreleased red creme polish. <laughs> now we stir. And now I'm mixing all my cocktails inspired by drinks that were inspired by cocktails. <laughs> I call this the pastel hollow rainbow cocktail. <laughs> all right, ready? Why does this taste so good? Something is wrong, this tastes good. I'll have the chaser anyways. I love Shirley Temples. Mmm, mmm, they taste like candy. Well, this turned out much better than expected, but I think I'll still stick to mixing nail polish. Remember though, don't drink the nail polish. All right, everybody, I hope you guys enjoyed this collection reveal video and I hope you love the new colors. I'm down with the pastel hollow vibes, look at me. Just a little pastel, don't tell. I'm so proud and excited for this one. I can finally wear it on my nails and actually tell you what it is. The link to shop is down below in the video description box or go to hollowtaco.com. See you in the cart and I'll buy you a drink. <laughs> All right, everybody. Thanks so much for your support and for watching. And I'll see y'all later. Don't spill my drink. Bye.